Okay, uh, this demonstration uh, is to help you understand one of the laws of nature. I'm going to put a little bit of water in there, about that much, I think. And I'm going to put the lid on there like this, set on the scale. I'm going to take a Alka-Seltzer tablet. Break the Alka Seltzer in half because I'm going to like try to fit it in there. But first, I'm going to weigh all this. Okay, right now it weighs 106.47 grams. 106.47 grams is what it weighs right now. Oh, come back here. I'm going to stick this in here. There it goes. There it goes. Okay, you know what's happening now, right? What's happening now? Hmm? Dissolving. What happens when you put alka in water? It disperses. it disperses. What's happening, Hadley? Dissolve. It's dissolving and it's fizzing, isn't it? Yeah. It's bubbling. It's making a gas. It's making a gas. It's bubbling. And eventually, what's going to happen here? It's just going to become a part of the water. It's just going to become part of the water, okay? It's, it, it's going to... It's going to be gone, okay? And it made a gas, right? Come on. And so now, if you look there, it's, let me get it up so they can see, it's clear. The Alka-Seltzer is gone. Okay. Now, here comes the tricky part. Predict what the mass is. Is it more or less? <coughs> Alka-Seltzer's gone is probably... More. Why is it more? I add. Well, I had everything on there. I weighed everything, and then I put the alka seltzer in, put the lid on. Now I'm weighing it again. The alka seltzer was sitting on top before. Okay. Well, I'll just read it off to you. It's one oh six point four seven grams. Okay. Even though the alka seltzer is gone, it weighs the same. I have just showed you. The law of nature called conservation of mass. Okay, conservation of mass tells us that we cannot create or destroy matter. Now, I was expecting some of you would say, "Well, it's going to weigh less, Mr. Johnson. The alpha is gone. It went, so it has to weigh less." But, but even though it looks like I destroyed the alpha seltzer, I didn't really destroy any matter. The alpha seltzer got changed into something different. That, and we can't see it, there was a gas produced, okay. Does gas have mass? We already know that gas has mass from an early experiment. Okay, I'm going to, like, open this cap just a little bit. Listen and see if you can hear. What, what do you think you're going to hear? Let's see. Did you hear anything? What was that sound? Gas coming out. I'm going to weigh it again. What do you think it's going to weigh? More or less same? Less. A lot of people saying less. Let's see if you're right. It's 106.12. 106.12 grams now. Okay. Why is it way less? If I didn't put the cap on, I might have thought I destroyed matter. Might have died. Okay. So what's the mass of the gas? That rhymes too, doesn't it? What's the mass of the gas? 30.35 grams. 0.35 grams is the mass of the gas that escaped. Okay, so again, this was a demonstration to show you what law of nature? Conservation of matter. Law of conservation of mass. Okay, that's good. Thank you.